Susan and her husband's marriage is strained after he loses his job and becomes resentful of her success as a fashion designer. Susan and her husband were once the epitome of marital bliss, their love a beacon of hope and harmony in a tumultuous world. However, the sudden loss of her husband's job at the prestigious law firm shattered the illusion of stability that had enveloped their relationship. His wounded pride and growing bitterness cast a dark shadow over their once vibrant home, suffocating the love that had once flourished between them. Susan watched helplessly as her husband's resentment towards her success as a renowned fashion designer festered, poisoning the air with silent accusations and unspoken grievances. Their conversations became laced with tension, each word a potential landmine in the minefield of their crumbling marriage. Despite Susan's attempts to bridge the growing divide with patience and understanding, her husband's wounded ego seemed insatiable, feeding off the perceived injustice of his situation. The disparity in their career trajectories became a catalyst for resentment, with her husband struggling to come to terms with his own sense of inadequacy in the face of Susan's rising star. What was once a partnership built on mutual respect and admiration was now a battleground of egos, each vying for supremacy in a relationship teetering on the brink of collapse. The loss of his job was not just a blow to their financial stability but also a blow to his sense of identity, leaving him adrift in a sea of uncertainty and self-doubt. As the walls of resentment grew taller, Susan found herself longing for the days when their love was unburdened by the weight of expectations and societal norms. Yet, beneath the surface of their strained interactions, the embers of their love still flickered, a testament to the bond that had once held them together. Susan refused to give up on the man she loved, clinging to the hope that they could weather this storm together and emerge stronger on the other side. Little did she know that the journey ahead would test the very foundations of their marriage, pushing them to confront their deepest fears and insecurities. In the midst of their turmoil, Susan found herself grappling with the harsh reality that love, no matter how pure, was not immune to the corrosive effects of pride and resentment. Yet, she remained steadfast in her belief that their love was worth fighting for, a beacon of hope in the darkness that threatened to consume them. As they navigated the treacherous waters of their strained marriage, Susan clung to the memories of their shared past, the laughter and the joy that had once defined their relationship. She refused to let their love become just another casualty of life's trials, determined to reclaim the happiness they had lost along the way. With each passing day, Susan found herself confronting the harsh realities of love and loss, grappling with the painful truth that sometimes, even the strongest of bonds could falter in the face of adversity. Yet, amidst the chaos of their fractured marriage, Susan held on to the hope that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. Little did she know that the road ahead would test their resolve like never before, pushing them to confront the demons that threatened to tear them apart. Susan receives an invitation to showcase her collection in Lagos, which exacerbates the tension in their relationship. The invitation to showcase her latest collection in Lagos was a dream come true for Susan, a validation of her years of hard work and dedication to her craft. Yet, as she eagerly shared the news with her husband, she could sense the growing tension in the air, his forced smile betraying the turmoil within. His reaction was like a dagger to her heart, his eyes clouded with resentment as he struggled to mask his own insecurities in the face of her success. The prospect of Susan's trip to Lagos became a source of contention between them, a glaring reminder of the growing chasm that threatened to swallow their marriage whole. Despite her best efforts to assuage his fears and reassure him of her love, his jealousy and resentment only seemed to intensify with each passing day. The once harmonious rhythm of their marriage had been replaced by a cacophony of unspoken tensions and simmering resentments, leaving Susan feeling adrift in a sea of uncertainty. As the date of her departure drew nearer, the air between them grew heavy with unspoken words, each moment a painful reminder of the rift that had formed between them. 
Susan found herself torn between her desire to pursue her dreams and her fear of further alienating her husband, caught in a web of conflicting emotions that threatened to consume her. Yet, deep down, she knew that she could not let her husband's insecurities dictate the course of her life, nor could she allow his resentment to overshadow her own happiness. With a heavy heart and a sense of resignation, Susan boarded the plane to Lagos, her mind consumed with thoughts of what awaited her on the other side. The vibrant energy of Lagos greeted her like a warm embrace, a stark contrast to the cold silence that had enveloped her marriage back home. As she immersed herself in the hustle and bustle of the city, Susan felt a sense of liberation wash over her, a freedom she had long for but never dared to embrace. The opportunity to showcase her collection was not just a chance to further her career but also a chance to reclaim her sense of self, to rediscover the woman she had lost in the midst of her husband's insecurities. Yet, even amidst the excitement of the event, Susan could not shake the feeling of guilt that gnawed at her insides, a nagging reminder of the husband she had left behind. As she watched her designs come to life on the runway, a sense of pride swelled within her, tempered by the knowledge that her success came at a cost. The applause of the audience was a bittersweet symphony of validation, a reminder of the sacrifices she had made in pursuit of her dreams. And as she stood amidst the glitz and glamour of the fashion world, Susan found herself longing for the simplicity of her life back home, for the husband whose love she feared she had lost. Yet, even in the midst of her doubts and insecurities, Susan knew that she could not turn back, that she had to see this journey through to its end, whatever the cost. For better or for worse, Lagos had become a crucible of transformation for Susan, a place where she would confront her deepest fears and emerge stronger on the other side. And as she prepared to return home, Susan braced herself for the storm that awaited her, knowing that her journey was far from over, that the hardest challenges still lay ahead. Despite her husband's objections, Susan goes to Lagos, where she finds validation but realizes the emptiness of success without his support. Stepping off the plane in Lagos, Susan was greeted by a wave of heat and humidity, the air thick with the promise of new beginnings and untold possibilities. As she made her way through, the bustling streets of the city, Susan felt a sense of exhilaration wash over her, a feeling of liberation she had not experienced in years. The opportunity to showcase her collection was a chance to reclaim her sense of self, to prove to herself and to the world that she was more than just a wife or a mother, that she was a force to be reckoned with in her own right. Yet, even amidst the excitement of the event, Susan could not shake the feeling of loneliness that gnawed at her insides, a sense of emptiness that no amount of success could fill. The applause of the audience was a welcome validation of her talent and hard work, yet it rang hollow in the absence of her husband's support and encouragement. As she mingled with industry insiders and rubbed shoulders with the elite of the fashion world, Susan found herself longing for the simplicity of her life back home, for the husband whose love she feared she had lost. And as she watched the city lights twinkle like distant stars, Susan realized that success, no matter how glittering, held no value without the love and support of those who mattered most. The journey to Lagos had been a test of her courage and resilience, a chance to confront her deepest fears and emerge stronger on the other side. Yet, even as she basked in the glow of her success, Susan knew that her journey was far from over, that the hardest challenges still lay ahead. With a heavy heart and a sense of resignation, Susan boarded the plane back home, her mind consumed with thoughts of the husband she had left behind. As the plane soared through the night sky, Susan found herself grappling with the harsh reality of her situation, torn between her dreams and the crumbling ruins of her marriage. Yet, even amidst the uncertainty and doubt, Susan knew that she could not give up on her husband, that she had to fight for the love they had forged together. For better or for worse, Lagos had become a crucible of transformation for Susan, 
a place where she had confronted her deepest fears and emerged stronger on the other side. And as she prepared to face the storm that awaited her at home, Susan braced herself for the challenges that lay ahead, knowing that her journey was far from over. For in the quiet moments of solitude, amidst the chaos of her fractured marriage, Susan found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as she stepped off the plane and into the waiting embrace of her husband, Susan knew that her journey was far from over, that the hardest challenges still lay ahead. Yet, with a heart full of courage and a spirit tempered by adversity, Susan was ready to face whatever the future held, knowing that she was not alone, that her husband was by her side. For in the end, Susan realized that the true measure of success lay not in the accolades of strangers but in the love and support of those who mattered most. And as she looked into her husband's eyes, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. Her husband rejects her upon her return home, leaving Susan adrift and contemplating the value of their relationship. Stepping through the door of her home, Susan was met with a deafening silence, the emptiness of the house a stark reminder of the husband she had left behind. Her footsteps echoed hollowly in the empty hallway, the sound a haunting reminder of the void that had formed between them. As she made her way through the house, Susan felt a sense of dread settle over her, a feeling of foreboding that seemed to seep into her bones. And then she saw him, sitting alone in the dimly lit living room, his form tense and guarded as he turned to face her. In that moment, Susan knew that something had changed that the man she loved was no longer the same, that the chasm between them had grown too vast to bridge. His rejection was like a dagger to her heart, his words a cruel reminder of the love they had lost along the way. And as she stood there, her heart heavy with sorrow, Susan found herself grappling with the harsh reality of her situation, with the knowledge that her marriage was crumbling before her eyes. Yet, even amidst the pain and the heartache, Susan refused to give up on the man she loved, knowing that their love was worth fighting for, whatever the cost. For in the depths of her despair, Susan found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as she looked into her husband's eyes, Susan saw a glimmer of something she had thought long lost, a spark of recognition amidst the darkness that threatened to consume them. With a trembling voice and a heart full of fear, Susan reached out to him, her hand outstretched in a silent plea for forgiveness. And in that fragile moment, something shifted between them, a recognition of the pain they had both endured, of the love they had both lost along the way. For in the quiet embrace of the night, as the city lights twinkled like distant stars, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. And as they stood there, their hearts laid bare before each other, Susan felt a sense of peace wash over her, a feeling of belonging that she had thought long lost. For in that moment, amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the end, Susan knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan felt a sense of peace settle over her, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. Susan realizes that love transcends material success and decides to fight for her marriage. As Susan grappled with the harsh reality of her crumbling marriage, she found herself confronting a truth she had long ignored, that love, in all its complexity, was not defined by material success or societal norms. For too long, 
she had allowed herself to be consumed by the pursuit of external validation, to measure her worth by the accolades of strangers rather than the love of her husband. Yet, in the quiet moments of solitude, amidst the chaos of her fractured marriage, Susan found herself yearning for something more, for a love that transcended the trappings of success and ambition. And as she looked into her husband's eyes, Susan saw a reflection of her own pain and loneliness. A recognition of the love they had lost along the way. With a heavy heart and a sense of determination, Susan made a vow to herself, to fight for the love they had forged together, whatever the cost. For in the end, she knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no amount of success or recognition could ever replace the bond they shared. And as she reached out to her husband, her hand trembling with fear and uncertainty, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the depths of her despair, Susan found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as they stood there, their hearts laid bare before each other, Susan felt a sense of peace wash over her, a feeling of belonging that she had thought long lost. For in that moment, amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the end, Susan knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan felt a sense of peace settle over her, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. She returns home to reconcile with her husband, and they both express vulnerability and forgiveness, rebuilding their relationship. With a heavy heart and a sense of determination, Susan returned home, her mind consumed with thoughts of the husband she had left behind. As she stepped through the door of their home, Susan felt a sense of trepidation wash over her, a feeling of uncertainty that seemed to hang in the air like a heavy fog. Yet, Despite her fears, Susan knew that she could not let her doubts and insecurities dictate the course of her life, nor could she allow her pride to stand in the way of reconciliation. With a trembling hand and a heart full of hope, Susan reached out to her husband, her voice soft and tentative as she spoke of her fears and regrets. And as she poured out her heart to him, laying bare her deepest insecurities and vulnerabilities, Susan felt a sense of liberation wash over her, a feeling of freedom she had not experienced in years. For in that moment, amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as her husband listened, his eyes filled with tears, Susan felt a sense of peace settle over her, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. For in the end, Susan knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the depths of her despair, Susan found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as they stood there, their hearts laid bare before each other, Susan felt a sense of peace wash over her, a feeling of belonging that she had thought long lost. For in that moment, amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the end, Susan knew that their love was worth fighting for, 
that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan felt a sense of peace settle over her, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. Together, they embark on a journey to nurture their love and overcome past hurts, united in their commitment to each other, with a newfound sense of purpose and a determination to rebuild their shattered marriage, Susan and her husband embarked on a journey of healing and renewal. Theirs was a love that had weathered the storms of life, a bond forged in the crucible of adversity and strengthened by the trials they had faced together. And as they navigated the treacherous waters of their fractured relationship, Susan and her husband found themselves confronting their deepest fears and insecurities, laying bare their hearts before each other in a fragile dance of vulnerability and forgiveness. For in the end, they knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan and her husband felt a sense of peace settle over them, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. For in the end, Susan and her husband realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan and her husband knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the depths of their despair, they found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as they stood there, their hearts laid bare before each other, Susan and her husband felt a sense of peace wash over them, a feeling of belonging that they had thought long lost. For in that moment, Amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan and her husband realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan and her husband knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the end, Susan and her husband knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan and her husband felt a sense of peace settle over them, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other. In the end, Susan and her husband realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan and her husband knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the depths of their despair, they found a flicker of hope, a belief that love, in all its complexity, had the power to heal even the deepest of wounds. And as they stood there, their hearts laid bare before each other, Susan and her husband felt a sense of peace wash over them, a feeling of belonging that they had thought long lost. For in that moment, amidst the ruins of their fractured marriage, Susan and her husband realized that their love was not defined by the trials they faced but by the strength of their commitment to each other. And as they embraced, tears mingling with unspoken words, Susan and her husband knew that their journey was far from over, that the road ahead would be long and difficult, but that together, they could weather any storm. For in the end, Susan and her husband knew that their love was worth fighting for, that no matter what obstacles they faced, they would emerge stronger on the other side. And as they stepped into the unknown horizon, hand in hand, Susan and her husband felt a sense of peace settle over them, a knowing that no matter what lay ahead, they would face it together, united in their love for each other.